I promised you that every day we're going to try to give you one good piece of news. And today, obviously, we are mocking uh, celebrities and their push to be more radical and more controversial when in reality, what they look like to us is just sad and that's what they are. But there is one person that is in the news. You might remember him, Frankie Muniz. He had a hit sitcom when he was a child called Malcolm in the Middle. And usually, as I have shown very much on this podcast, child stars end up, they're doomed. They're just doomed. I mean, whether you're talking about Amanda Bynes, uh, you know, and what she is going through. Uh, mentally, we have seen that play out, where, whether you're talking about Britney Spears. There are so many examples of them. They just don't turn out right mentally. Well, here is a different circumstance. This star, Frankie Muniz, he's now 38 years old. And he is speaking out about the fact that he has never in his entire life had a sip of alcohol. Take a listen. Moving to Scottsdale in 2008, I think saved my life. And I don't mean that in the sense like where I was, I'm, I'm 38, I've still never had a sip of alcohol. I've never done drugs. I've never done anything. So I don't mean in that sense. I don't mean in that, in like the sense of like, oh, I'm going to go off a, off the deep end. At 18 years old was the first time that I was really kind of around it. And in my mind, going back to the time thing, I felt like I had made it so long without it that I was kind of like, well, I'm not going to start now. That is wonderful. That is so wonderful to hear that somebody could make it out of Hollywood despite being offered alcohol. He just said, you know what? I've made it this long when he was just obviously very young buck, 18 years old, and I just don't want to have it. And then he moved away out of Hollywood and you can just see the lightness in his eyes. It's a rare story, but a remarkable one. And it's worth sharing that not every person that goes into Hollywood comes out demented with tons of issues. Um, he seems remarkably happy. And like I said, you can still see that light in his eyes. So kudos to you, Frankie Muniz, for being an example, uh, I think, for the industry, which they're probably not going to allow you to lead by your example, but also to all of us to know that you can resist and, and you don't have to give in to that particular culture. And what's on the end of that, if you do resist Hollywood, Hollywood and Hollywood trends, it's probably going to be a lot of happiness. Hey guys, if you like this video, you will definitely like the full episode even better. You can find it by clicking right here.